Hello and welcome back to Humankind. Last episode we left off on our little ship exploring the ocean. Um, I wish I could upgrade it to a missile cruiser, but sadly we have no oil. And that is what we're trying to find. So I'm going to scour some of these islands in hope that they have at least some oil, aluminum, or even uranium. I am really hoping, right now at least, for some oil or uranium. However, it looks like there is nothing on this island. Which blows. Um, ah, man. There should be some there's oil down here. Not a lot, though. Sadly, do I even have lead? I do not. How do you do, whoever you are? Okay. Ah. All right, head over there. Might not be too bad of a spot to, um... to land from though, honestly. And there's stuff up here. There's pearls right there. At this point, I'm just looking for anything. Why does the fog give me detection range and vision? Plus one vision range for fog. I am putting out a lot of pollution. <laughs> oh gosh. Mercury. Ah, oil. Perfect, okay. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, let's go ahead and build this. Uh, you... Okay, cool. Um... I want to build an engineer. They established new cities. I guess it would have to be a city, okay. Go ahead. Bonk you in there. Boom. 
Will they survive? That is my question. This is not going to be a very good city either, but... Do they have the option? Well, can't click on them. Do they have the option to just... Okay, cool, they do. Oh, okay, yeah, they can add city as well. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Um... Okay, it's out, out of the game area. It's fine. I really need two oil to do anything good, though. That's the problem. Thirst for energy has no limits. The planet does. Now we can take what we need while leaving something for the future. Ah, just copper. I don't have any more. Okay, so what does that do? <clears throat> I've created that, so is there something I can do with that? Okay, so not really. <laughs> is what I'm understanding anyway. Okay. Head that way. Don't have a missile silo yet. A nuclear missile silo. Don't brag about it, or else everybody else will start building them. It's not really much we can do. Uh oh, I forgot shift. Stability.
Yep, that'll build that. And, uh, well, I guess I could claim another wonder. Oh, can I not claim another wonder? Maybe I have to wait till this turn's over. Ah, there's nothing out here. Um, who has the most population? Thebes. I'm gonna take one. Well, I guess y'all could just move up here. Just nothing. Oil right there. Just a whole lot of nothing. Let's go ahead and create some more. I oh, would need more. I'll just auto explore, I guess. It's not like going to find any more oil anytime soon. Unless somebody all of a sudden starts making it. But it doesn't look like it. Tell me what is on your mind. Cole, I don't need any of that though. I have obsidian, correct? Yeah, I got plenty of that. I have silk, yep. We'll get pearls with this. Add in that. Uh, 
And then I guess, um, go down here and found another one. Will Thebes get to... Ooh, that's a lot. Uh, they probably will not. Let's go ahead and claim that. Uh, I want to put... Right there. That means Memphis as well. I wish they had just like regular missiles, like, you know, they don't have to be nuclear. Why can't they just be like just regular old missiles? I could create some commandos. I have enough money to. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think it's eight. Okay, there we go. Let's put it right there. Incredible. Ten territories pulled together into a single megalopolis. The next challenge is to come up with a suitably epic name. I don't know how many territories I have that are 10, but <laughs> I'll take it. Um, you, there's really just nothing else for y'all to do. I mean, all the land's pretty much taken up. I mean, I guess I can go down here and pop down another one. Maybe one more down there, but pretty much it. <laughs> what do these guys have? Hmm. That's interesting. I think we should go pay them a visit.
Okay, look, we'll finally see the train uh, in action. I did, for some reason, this didn't work for me last game. Like, I was playing this, uh, you know, played this game a few times over, and for some reason, the trains never did work, but I guess they worked all the way. They patched it up or something. I don't know. I'm very interested if whoops as a place of safety and a symbol of power only your friends know of the extensive wine cellar okay I still don't have mounted warfare <laughs> go ahead and get that I guess <laughs> uh okay I think if we finish this, um, pretty much lose. I'm gonna go ahead and take off fusion reactor. Why can I not clump? Is it just like really weird? Okay, it must be the po the population or something like decreasing or something decreasing, decreasing. Um, I kind of want to take out these guys and get uranium, oil. No telling what else is over there. It's all it's silver. What's the problem? Ah, come on, Avaris. Ah, they're besieging. Okay, well, just uh, let's skip. Let's kind of wait that out. Okay, why is this? Oh, I see, because these people. Talent must be found and nurtured. Is that it? Though flowers can be and let me go ahead. This looks lovely. Let's do that. Let's see how it goes in practice. Once they finish that up, uh, what do they have here? Oh, they just have little old chariots. That's fun. We'll easily wipe them out. 
Vegas Opera House are even more impressive when you consider the fact that the plans were rescued from the trash can. Oh, is this one done yet? Yes, it is. Good, good, good. I probably won't need anything else. Uh, oh. Just go ahead and make that, uh, industry. There we go. Oh, I have to select the technology. Oh man, I hope that doesn't end. I really wanted to launch a nuclear bomb. You'll soon be using stacks of banknotes. I might just prolong it a little bit longer so I can get those bombs. Um, can I upgrade anything yet? I don't think so. No, I need to. Whether they're smarter or luckier, they've risen above the rest. Probably should have got the, um... Let's see what we have here. Yep. Let's see, learning, production, just do a production, whatever. Okay, and place it down there. Hmm. Ooh, what is that? No. With so many cultures and traditions, it takes a lot of voices. The march of human history. Well, here we are. Making your place in it an even greater achievement. No other civilization has equaled your ability to leave a lasting mark on humankind. History will not remember you as a warrior or banker or farmer. Your fame was garnered more or less everywhere. And the wonder you built. World famous and often visited. It brought you fame, respect, and probably a nice income from tourism. One more testament to your perseverance. Part of your legacy was being involved in the longest war in history. Congratulations. Under your guidance, the thrilling tale of humankind has been rewritten in your own words. There may be future adventures and deeds, and even grander scope for this grand story. Regardless, you have left a great mark 
and answered the question, how far will you push humankind? And that was it. We completed the game. Um, yeah, so I'm actually going to skip through this. I mean, wow, look at that. Second place. Almost double their score. Um, they were in the class clear. Wow. Okay. So I'm just going to go ahead and skip all that. No need. Uh, so yeah, here's our statistics. This is our fame. For a while there, we were with everybody else, and then around, I'm guessing this is about 250, maybe? We just, like, shot up, and that was it. Let's take a look at food. Food was off the chart. It would go up and go down and up and down and up and down. Um, industry, a steady climb. You can tell once we got into our final era, though, it was just, it was... Well, you can see we started Australians and it was <laughs> money. Same thing. Here's where I was buying stuff right here. <laughs> uh, science. Look at that. Straight up influence. Straight up again. Stability. Uh, we were kind of rocky and then we settled it right there. Let's take a look at population. Nice population. Look at that growth. Uh, religion, um, whoever this was, congratulations, they are obviously, oh, this must be the Siamese, or not the Siamese, what are they? Beowulf, uh, cool, our best city was Thebes, actually, hmm. cool. Okay, uh, research. Look at that. Wow, we were... We left the pack pretty early. Um, trade. We really got good on trade. Military. Ooh, wow, we were not that good on military for a while. These guys really crushed it. Um, cities. Cool. Alright. So I'm actually going to cut the recording now. Uh, and probably beat some empires real quick, get a nuclear weapon, and see what that looks like, because I've never seen one. So, yeah. Uh, I will see y'all in a bit. Hello, and we are back. Um, yeah. So, I went ahead, and I have two nuclear missiles. Well, I guess technically one is nuclear missile, and the other one is a thermo nuclear missile. So, I figure that we are going to have some fun with this. Okay. Well, let's just have a nuclear missile first. Okay, I'll declare war then. Um, relax. I had to act quickly, you understand? And here we go. Somebody had to have that planetary first. Congratulations on fixing your place in history. And I believe next turn it will do something. A nuclear missile site. Oh. No. I'm gonna miss it. Perhaps knowledge of its existence would ensure there we go. it gets used. Oh, whoa. <laughs> that looked amazing. Oh my god, did it just take off the map? Oh, it did. It just took it off the map. It completely obliterated it. Greetings. To what do I owe this pleasure? Whoa. <laughs> Wow. Okay, can I start? Yes. Was that really such a capital idea? Okay, here we go. Oh, I'm gonna miss it. No. Oh, wow! That one took out a big slice. Look how big that was. Oh my god. Let's go ahead and do that. This is literally all out nuclear war. <laughs> Let's go ahead and have them lined up. There we go.
And foom. They don't have to worry about those rebels anymore. Merely the brightest star in the heavens, but like the sun in the daytime, the only one visible. Boom. Wiped off. Does it destroy that one? Yes, okay. Will it destroy the other people even if I haven't declared war on them? The answer is... Yes, it looks like it. Yep, it just wiped them off. And we are... Nope, not at war. Cool. What grievance do they get there? They just get... Okay, they're just mad that I'd <laughs> stop their, their uh, <laughs> trade agreements. <laughs> Oof. Gone. Let's go ahead and move my people back. Ah! I don't think it'll destroy my city. I'm hoping it won't. It might have. Oh no, we're good. It just really decimated it, yeah. <laughs> Go ahead and clear these ruins up. Okay, well, that is going to be it. We pretty much just decimated an entire continent. Um, so, yeah, if y'all enjoyed that series, hit, hit the like button and let me know in the comments below, and I will do a season two. Uh, as always, I will catch y'all in the next one.